Okay, this video will show you how to make a screenshot and how to edit it in Paint. This is actually a PC video and it will be a little bit different if you're using a Mac. Um, okay, so uh, let's say I wanted to make a screenshot of this Digo. Now, there's different ways you need to do this. If you have a new kind of a keyboard that has the FN key, you have to use the FN key plus print screen. So you just hold on FN and then print screen and I use paint to edit my pictures paint is a free program you have in Windows now I'm gonna try and paste that picture, oh there it goes alright so here's my picture but it's got a lot of junk on it I don't want so I'm gonna actually crop this just go like this and I'm gonna cut it now let me open a new picture I don't want to save this one I'm going to just paste that one. Alright, so now I've got a picture. Now, I have to save as, and I want to make sure that I'm saving it as a JPEG or I could save it as a GIF, but I don't want to save it as a bitmap. Bitmaps are not good. So let's just save it as a JPEG, and I'm going to call it Digo Homepage. And usually you don't put spaces in these graphical names. Alright, so let me go to Moodle now. Okay, so now I'm in my Moodle. So anywhere place that there's an HTML editor, I can paste that screenshot. So for example, I could come down here, click on the little hand. And I'm going to use this button here, the insert image button. Oh, I'm going to make sure my cursor is where I want it to be. I'm going to browse for the picture. So, where the heck did I save it? There it is. And then I have to upload it. It appears here. And I can see here that it's way, 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 way too big. So, I'm going to cut this in half. So, it'll be about 600 and. 90, I guess, I don't know. And then 250, say 260. And I have to give it a caption. And then it'll appear here. So let's save changes. If you have an old style keyboard, instead of using the FN key plus print screen, you would use the alt key plus the print screen and in the Mac you use the Apple key I believe and the print screen key so give it a try remember you can use paint or any graphical editor that you have to edit the picture so that it looks like how you want it to look alright give it a try